Hi everyone, my name is Edna and today I would like to share with you about Choice Theory Reality Therapy, which is also known as CTRT. The founder of CTRT is William Glasser, so this is one of his famous saying, the heart of reality therapy is what you choose to do in a relationship, not what others choose to do. And according to Glasser, you are responsible for your choice. The choice theory basic concept emphasizes on responsibility, rejection of transference, keeping the therapy in present, and avoid focusing on the symptoms. In reality therapy, it puts the responsibility of choosing goals on clients and we follow through with them. A good relationship with clients ensures that clients see that therapists are there to help them make changes which will make positive improvement in their life. Techniques are directed towards changing behaviors and focusing on strengths and accomplishments. So Glasser believed that we are not born blank slate, rather we are born with five genetically encoded needs. So these are the five basic needs, love and belonging, power, fun, survival and freedom. When these needs are not met, psychological problems result. When an individual is unable to fulfill a basic need, he or she will often choose a symptom behaviour as a way to cope. So Glasser also introduced quality work. Do you know what is in your quality work? So you can ask a few questions. What makes you feel loved? What makes you feel powerful? What do you do for fun? What makes you feel free? And what do you need to survive? So do you know the behaviour you have chosen and have been doing all this while? If you do not know, then Glasser also introduced Total Behaviour Car. Total behaviour includes four distinct, represented as the four wheels on the total behaviour car. The total behaviour car symbolises the human motivational system and the importance of each client taking responsibility for all four dimensions of behaviour, acting, thinking, feeling and physiology. So the two front wheels, acting and thinking, are emphasised when implementing the reality therapy procedures. The back wheel of the car, feelings and physiology are also critically important because they serve as early warning signals that clients are not moving smoothly towards their quality work or their design goal. So reality therapy uses a system termed WDEP. The system consists of establishing what the client wants, what they have doing, evaluate how helpful their actions have been and to plan for how they want to behave in the future. So the key procedures in reality therapy is the WDEP system mentioned. W is wants and need, D is doing and direction, E evaluation and P plans and actions. Changing what we do is the key to changing what we feel and to getting what we want. So you can plan for a change by using the SAMIC method. Simple, attainable, measurable, immediate and involved and controlled. So stages in reality therapy, first you start with build a good relationship, examine the current behaviour, evaluate behaviour, helpful or not, brainstorm alternative, commit to new plan, evaluate result, no punish or excuses, accept logical and natural consequences and don't get discouraged. So Glasser also introduced the habits we can do. First is the 7 deadly habits. So the 7 deadly habits include criticizing, blaming, complaining, nagging, threatening, punishing, bribing or reward of control. However, Glasser changed the terms to the 7 caring habits. The 7 caring habits include supporting, encouraging, listening, accepting, trusting, respecting and negotiating differences. People use the 7 deadly habits because they want to take control of situation. Why? It is faster than using the 7 caring habit. But using the 7 deadly habit will diminish the relationship. So what is your choice? So the summary for this video is Client has the choice, WDEP system, 5 basic needs, quality work, total behavior car, stages in CTRT, 7 deadly and caring habits. So thank you for watching and have fun learning.